Hi everyone, it's Kim and I am here with another project share. Um, I did this, uh, I don't know, probably two or three weeks ago and just haven't had a chance to get it video to show everybody what I have done. So let me move my sign and I will show you what I have made. I have altered this beautiful little jar which I got at um, Michael's. It held um, Recollections uh, flowers in it. And uh, of course I used up all the flowers so I had the jar left over and it has this beautiful uh, wooden lid on it. So I altered this up and this um, holds um, my stamens that I use in my projects. And the paper line that I used on this was um, Graphic 45. Let's see if I can get a better angle. I used the Graphic 45 uh, uh, Lay Romantique um, paper line and I took a piece of it and just wrapped it all the way around the jar. And then I, um, I distressed the, the edges with my Tim Holtz uh, distressing tool just to give it a shabby feel. And then I added this beautiful white uh, crocheted lace at the bottom and then added some of these beautiful um, black pearl trim all the way around and then on the, the lid itself what I did was I had this beautiful black guy per lace and I didn't have enough to go all the way around so what I did was I cut it into pieces and then just staggered the pieces around the jar and then the two pieces that I had left over are on the top and then I used um, some, um, what is that called, oh, gesso, and I gessoed the pearls and the black lace to make it stand out, and then I have this beautiful um, organza and satin trim that I added to the top along with more of that white crocheted lace. Had a brain cramp there. Couldn't remember what that was. And then more of the black pearls all the way around the jar. And then I have this beautiful doily on top. And then like I said I had two pieces of that lace left over so I just used them as leaves for underneath my flower clusters. And these are all Wild Orchid Craft flowers. I have the um 35 millimeter the pink uh, tone pack where you get four different colors so I used uh, three of those the trellis roses and then I have some cottage roses tucked in which are the pale pink and then I have these black open roses which I believe are the 20 millimeter and then I have some of these rose buds tucked in around as well. These are the hip rosebuds. And then I used some of my stamens and I tucked them in around the flower cluster. And then I also have these little pearls, little pink pearls that I put in around as well. So that's the top of the jar and like I said it opens. And I didn't I didn't do anything with the wood. I wanted to keep that as natural as possible. Like I said it holds all my stamens and then it just goes back on and then it sits on my my desk and I get to look at it all the time really pretty so that was uh, the project that I wanted to share with you and I hope you like it and uh, please feel free to leave a comment uh, down below and thanks for watching